All right, so I wanted to give you guys a few tips on putting your final path together. Um, so imagine we've got like this bubble just full of plant pictures, and this guy over here has stuff, and this one has text and a video. In order to actually set up your presentation, we've got this giant poster, and now what order do you want it to play through? So we're going to go to Edit Path, and we can see our first one. And the first thing you can do is just click on anything and it becomes part two maybe we want to click on this one and that whole thing will be part three you can also click on the words and it will zoom into those words as part four click on the movie the movie becomes part five even something outside of the words, like these random words over here, are step six. And if you want to, over here, you can actually zoom into those spots. There it goes. Random text over here. But let's zoom out really quick. And I do want to show you one more thing that will be very useful to you guys. So we've got tons and tons of pictures, right? And we can't really click through all of them, but maybe you want to zoom in on a group of them. We add a frame. We'll put it around the pictures. And now this frame can become number two. Let's edit the path. And actually, you know what? Before it goes to number three, after two, you see this little plus symbol? After one, there's a plus. After three, there's a plus. If we take this after two, and drag it over to this flower, that flower becomes number three, and this one is now number four. After four, I want it to go over to this random text, that becomes five, and so on. And you can delete anything off the, just off the path, right over here. I'm not deleting that random text, but I'm deleting it off the path. So let's take a look at how it's, how it's working so far. Number one is the whole circle. Two is just those pictures. The whole image, if you want to do an individual image, that box might be something else. To the words, so this is how you can do your definitions. And then it will actually play and start the movie. This is the Man of Steel. Alright, hopefully you guys get the idea of the path. I did that kind of quick, but you can always pause and watch it again.